Hello, and in this video we're gonna um take take our editor that we installed in the last video, and we're gonna make it so that it's more difficult for people to screw up your site with it. Um, like I said in the last video, WYSIWYGs are generally bad because they put a tool in people's hands that they can inadvertently mess your site up with. Um, so it's very important to restrict these kind of these kind of things. So that is why I use the tiny MCE editor because it's very customizable. The, as you can see right up front, the first thing we need to do is customize the layout because the buttons are on the bottom, which just isn't familiar enough to people. Um, so we're just gonna go to Tiny MC. And then we're gonna edit it, and it gives us this thing. So all we're gonna do is um, choose the editor appearance, and we're gonna get rid of the things that we don't need and that we think people could screw up our site with. Um, so we want. First of all, we want to change the toolbar to the top, and we want to um, do that. And we also want to edit it again. Um, to change some of the buttons that you get on it. And it's very important that you don't just let it run away with um with you. And if you look on the clean up and output tab you um want to make it verify the HTML so that, so that it's as clean as possible because these editors have very dirty code which is the reason why I don't use them and then in the CSS tab you want to use the theme CSS you do not want to give them an option to, to change the CSS so now, if, if we go back to our blog entry, there we are. So, I think it's just a philosophy thing really. You have to remember that you're the designer and you're the one designing the site, not the person that's writing the content. So, they shouldn't be able to break all hell loose on the site because um, the, the look will eventually end up looking horrible and getting screwed up so I'm going to go and disable this module because I hate WYSIWYGs and leave you with your Drupal thank you, thank you for watching I hope you enjoyed I hope it's helped and I'll see you in the next video thank you